Well, we're continuing to track one last day of this hot and humid weather across mid-Missouri, at least for a little while as we head into these next couple of days. Afternoon highs going to be topping out in the low 90s. That's what you want to prepare for. These afternoon pop-up storms still possible as we close out our Sunday afternoon into the evening hours. But again, by then, damage is already done. We're in those uh, triple digits for those heat indices. Could be right around 105. But into this evening, again, things going to stay fairly quiet as we work our way through about 8 and 10 o'clock. I think by midnight, though, we could be tracking some showers and thunderstorms moving on in. Here's the latest look at future track. There's those spotty afternoon storms here. We've kind of gotten used to these last couple of days, but up toward the north and west again, going to be tracking a cold front working its way on in by about 11 and 12 o'clock later on tonight. That's going to start to continue to work its way off toward the south and east and get up some showers and thunderstorms for our Monday morning commute. As that continues to work off that direction, still get you up to five o'clock tomorrow as we head home from work. Still could be hearing a few rumbles of thunder, but not expecting anything in the way of strong or even severe weather for that matter. It just looks like some garden variety showers and thunderstorms as Mother Nature blows off a little bit of steam and actually is in the process of doing a bit of a pattern change here across mid-Missouri. The average highs typically in the upper 80s this time of year. We're going to be below that over these next couple of days, but really for much of this week, and it's going to be feeling a lot better, especially by the time Tuesday rolls around. Look at these dew point temperatures again, right around 70 degrees in those low 70s. That's where things have been over these last couple of days. But there's that frontal boundary working its way off toward the south by Tuesday afternoon absolutely spectacular. You cannot beat that this time of year. Looking at rain tracker though, unfortunately we've got more rain chances around the corner. They're not as likely though by Wednesday, Thursday, even into Friday as we get into the uh, second half of this work week. I think the weekend's at least trending dry as of right now. So that's a little bit of good news. But the bad news is if we do see some of these uh, rain chances materialize one to three inches by the time this time next week rolls around, certainly could be picked up here along and north of I-70. I think some of our southern counties could be picking up anywhere from about three to four inches here by the time things all shake out here with some of these rain chances just about daily, Wednesday, Thursday, even into Friday. And that is including this uh, round on Monday that we're going to be tracking tomorrow. Looking at that ABC 17 storm track seven day forecast, though, it to be tough to beat that, especially by Tuesday. Absolutely beautiful weather set to unfold on the second day this week, but temperatures hanging out in the 80s. We'll take that this time of year.